Hey everyone, welcome back to my garden. It's been four months since I last updated you with this hydroponic aloe plant. It's looking really, really good, I think. It's been, like I said, four months. You could see there's some new growth developing, and I'll post the link, of course, down in the description bar for the last time I, up, I put this thing in the system. You'll see just how big it was. And if we take a look at the root system, it's growing in a regular cranky system. You could see the roots are looking nice and healthy. Now, this is just plain water. I didn't add any hydroponic nutrients to it. And this is from the time I planted it. This is how much it drank up. I never added any water. I never refilled it. You can see the bottom of the jar. There's no algae. I didn't even cover the jar at all. The roots have been exposed to the lights growing under these T5 lights. And doing really, really well, I think. You can see just how big it is. When I put my hand right there, and look at the video from last last time, you really see how big the plant grew. Very very healthy, I think. It got a little bent right here at this spot, so I'm gonna have to be careful with that. It may break eventually, but for now it's doing pretty good. Let me lift this thing up. You could see the root system a little bit closer. So not too big. I see the very tip right there looks a little bit black. I'm not sure what that is. That might just be some cocoa core at the very tip. But overall, growing really well. I'm debating if I should add hydroponic fertilizer to this plant or not since it's been growing really well. I don't want to mess it up. And let me show you another example of something similar. I planted this on December 8th. I just took some cuttings from my Stringer Pro plant and I stuck it in here. Put some cocoa core and some, uh, what is it, some clay pebbles right there at the bottom. About 50% clay pebbles and then 50% cocoa core up top. And I, this is the same thing, just water. Haven't watered this thing at all. Threw the water in. Covered the basically about a quarter, quarter inch, something like that, of the jar. And the roots began to grow. You could see beautiful root system right there. Let's lift this thing up. You guys could see a little bit closer what it looks like, there you go. So doing really, really well, I think. And this is a succulent plant, same thing like this. So in the Kratky system, great, great method. Haven't watered these thing once. Haven't watered this in four months, like I said. And this has basically been one month here. So it's exciting for those, for those of you who are terrible at keeping your plants alive due to watering, so you could just throw it in the Kratky system, sit it and forget it basically. You could see right here at the bottom I'm focusing in like tiny new, I don't even know what you call it, I guess just little pearls. That's all new growth. And on all of them, let me zoom it around, flip it around. You could see little growth here and there. Overall doing well I think. So I'm gonna keep that grow going. I'm happy I marked the date. You should always mark the date when you plant stuff. Because it's very easy to forget. So these two plants are doing good. We're going to be back soon for more episodes. As always, if you liked the episode, don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And subscribe. Thanks for watching.